Hey Libra, it's your girl Spiritual Sage, baby. I don't have any Libra in my chart. Hmm. Anyway, this is your monthly love, okay? These aren't that long. We're just getting a gist of what in the fuck is going on in your life, what's coming in and or going out, all right? Uh, you can have Libra anywhere in your chart. Take what resonates. If this doesn't resonate, go and check out another placement on my channel, all right? Um, I welcome cross watches over here. Okay, baby? All right, Spirit, what's going on for the Libras? But my good, good friend is a Libra. He's a male, but he's, he's a Libra. He's awesome. I moved from poverty thinking to abundance thinking. After you surrender, you're going to have to surrender something. It could just be the lack mentality. Once you surrender, that abundance is going to come in your life, right? Okay. All right, and then let's see what's crowning the read. Yeah, I forgive my old ass chair. I'm on hardwood floor. Every time I move it, make noise. Forgive it. Okay, Spirit, what's crowning the reading for my Libras? Whoa. Y'all ain't going through that damn much. Spirit, what's going on with the Libras? Growth, baby. Hell yeah, you growing. Coming up out of that lack mentality. All right, getting ready to manifest. Bottom of the deck, courage. Yes, I like this, Libra. Getting some courage about yourself. Getting some business about yourself, okay? Growing and shit. That's what this soul, this spiritual journey is about. Growth, okay? Expanding your consciousness and your awareness. Okay, spirit, so what's going on for my Libras? Ooh, child, don't tell me you got no loyal heart coming in this thing. All right. And what else? Uh-oh. Justice. You might be, baby. Possibly, if you surrender this connection and this is something that you wanted, guess what? It's coming in. Huh. That's what you did. You surrendered it. You said, fuck it, man. Started meditating. Started healing yourself. Working on yourself. Redirected your energy. And now, because you got out of that lack mentality, this loyal heart is about to come in. And the Most High God says, this is your justice. You learned something. Pretty much, you've learned how to manifest. Okay? Yep. You, you Listen, growth, change, courage. Something about to change up in this thing. So, let's see. I like it either way. This is definitely someone who's learned how to manifest. And you're manifesting in a loyal heart. Okay, spirit. So, what's going on with the Libras for their monthly love? Uh-oh. Yeah, you done went with it. Did a little soul searching. Mm-hmm. Might have a little Virgo in your chart. But either way, where you're going is heading towards balance. Six of swords for their ass. Okay, spirit. Uh-oh. Your wishes is going to be fulfilled, baby. You coming up out of that lack. Five of pentacles in the reverse. I like it. I like it. I'm talking about for real. Okay, Libra. Mm-hmm. And I told you. You don't even know that this is coming in for you. Because you done surrendered it. You done started focusing on yourself. This is the Libra card. This justice card is the Libra's card. Okay? You done started focusing on yourself. Don't tell me you ain't because I see you done got your hair done, your nails done. You done went to the spa and done got a massage. Look at you. You redirected your energy. You took it off of this twin flame or this deep soul connection and you put it on yourself. And that's how you manifest. You put your wishes into the into the world, to the universe, and you release it. And so you have no idea that this person is coming in. You don't know just how much you have grown when you have learned to release the outcome of something. There's a lot of growth here. Because in society, in today's society, we won't share like this. And we, we watch it, we hold on to it. You've done a lot of growing and changing. Okay, and so what's coming in for you? This is this is telling me you learn how to manifest. That's energy. You know how to manipulate the energy. And so what you did was, all the energy you was putting into that, there it is again, I can't make it up. Soulmate. All the energy you was putting into that soulmate, that two of cups, that loyal heart, okay, all the energy you was putting into that person, what you did 
was learn how to manipulate that energy. You started putting it into yourself. Getting your hair and nails done, toes, taking care of yourself, paying your bills on time, wishing a bitch would, okay? And so you released it. And so now that's what's coming in. Your wishes will be fulfilled. It's out here. Nine of cups, milk and honey. Wow. Wow. I like this label. I mean, I love it. You did that. Pat yourself on the back. And that's the motherfucking truth. And I'm talking about for real. That's the truth. You did that. When you moved away from poverty thinking to abundance thinking, when you surrendered this damn connection, now it's coming in, baby. And you don't know how much you've grown. Victory. Victory and success. Nine of cups. Ten of cups. Wow. With soulmate, loyal heart, two of cups. This is your justice, Libra. Oh, my God. What else, spirit? Now you got something to celebrate. Now you're going to have something to celebrate because your wishes is about to be fulfilled. I see victory all over this reading and growth. This is powerful. This is powerful. Right? You were. You were coming from a lack. That four of pentacles, that's lack mentality. But then you took action. King of Wands. You took action, redirected your energy, and now this is what's coming in for you. You could very well have a King of Wands coming in for you, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. But baby, this is something loyal. This is a soulmate, a deep soul connection that's coming in for your ass. I like it. And that's on everything. Shit, I don't even think it's nothing you need to surrender. Man, listen. Baby. <laughs> you were scared of hell. Yes, you was in the past. Scared that this person wasn't going to come back, holding on to it, constantly thinking about it, constantly praying and asking about it. When you said fuck it, that whole big bucket of fuck it, when you put that big bucket of fuck it out there and you started redirecting your energy and going and getting your nails and toes and shit done, took that leap of faith on yourself, baby. There it is. There it is, man. I mean, this this is the best reading I've done besides Sagittarius read. Okay? Your hard work is paid off. You know how to do it now. You know how to manifest now. And you wish a bitch would. Yeah. Okay? So, let's just see if you have any surrender cards. Alright? Now, if this, not, if this is not you, Libra... Uh, this is someone external to you. But I think this is Libra, okay? Libra, uh, spirit, does Libra have anything they need to surrender? Ooh, surrender your self-esteem. You deserve success, love, and abundance. Set an intention to identify and release any remnants of low self-esteem. Okay, so if you have not done that, that's exactly what you need to do. Surrender it. Set the intentions. If you're telling spirit you want this soulmate to come in, spirit, I want the soulmate to come in and release it and redirect your energy, okay, on yourself. This is part of your soul's growth, um, learning how to really manifest. Because it, it all comes from lack. When you, when you feel the need to hold on to something like this right here, that's lack. Low self-esteem, lack mentality. You got to release that. Okay, but I, I I really feel like if you haven't done it, you you will. You will, and that's when this thing going to come in. So some of my Libras haven't done it, but most of my, my Libras have. Most of my Libras got that big bucket of fuck it and started redirecting their energy on themselves, started manifesting and meditating, getting the nails and toes and shit done, paying the bills on time. They were scared. Some of y'all were scared to release this thing. But Spirit said... That's all you got to do is release it and redirect your energy and watch what that very thing that you was holding on tight to and it wasn't never coming in for you, watch it come in. And I see it. Whether it was a love partner or abundance, you finna get both of them. You're about to get a loyal heart and milk and honey. Your wishes is about to be fulfilled. Your manifestations is coming. Okay? Wow. That's it. All right. Now, like I said, I do these once a month. Alright, if this resonates in any way, thumbs up the video. 
If you like the content that I create, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. If you haven't, uh, hit the uh, owl bell so that you get notified when I upload. And though these are once a month, I do put out daily content for the collective, okay? Baby. Whoever this is, bruh, all you got to do is surrender. And if you have done that, you've learned a major lesson. You have really learned how to manifest, and you can have just whatever the fuck you want. And that's on period. I see it. Six of Wands with the sun. And spirit say that's the damn truth. All you got to do is throw out a big bucket of fuck it. A big ass bucket of fuck it and you're going to get it. Watch. Okay? All right, Libra. Till next time. Mm, bye.